Good morning. Good morning. So it's funny how things change on our little venture we're on. We just, we're at this place, uh, which we'll show you. I don't even know where we are, but we're on the east side back on the, just, just north of Cabo. But we found a little guy here, he needs some help. So I'm gonna help him plumb his shower and his toilet in and in return, we get we can stay here. We use the facilities that we help with. Kristen might start cooking. So who knows, we might be here for a while um, as we decide on the on the puppies <laughs> and, and stuff. So today- um, Also, Ed slept in our bed all night last night and he did so good till about 5.30 this morning. Yeah, and today I am going to be a plumber. So, see you in a bit, babe. I'm going to work. Okay. This little shop uh, Buddy has here, coffee stand, and uh, he's trying to get make some RV sites. That's the point to get in the shower and uh, toilet and all everything going. More whales out there this morning. So they have a a well on a pump, obviously. So they ran the water this far. So from here, I got to add a the pump for the shower, a water filter, hook it up to their, hook it up to their propane heater here, and uh, then run a line into the shower, which is right here, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And then that's the sink I have to uh, install somehow, build a base for it, and figure that out as we go. So, one first job, get the pump installed, clean up the fittings here. That's why I got my wire brush and just start plumbing. So see how, yeah, Let's recap. Pump, filter in, drop the line in for the sink, just to have him figure out how I'm gonna install the sink because there's no, he doesn't have any wood or anything. I'm just scavenging what I can find. Hot and cold into the, uh, well, cold in, hot out of the uh, hot water. Those are those lines. Nothing fancy, but as you can see, uh, those heaters usually just have to have hot coming in, but he figures he's gonna just turn, crank it on hot, so it's always hot water, and then you can adjust it with the fresh water coming in as well, so you can, you know, get the right temperature for your shower. So yeah, nice big shower. So it's coming along, and uh, yeah, there's the sink. Then like I say, I gotta put the uh, here's the line for the sink, but I don't know the sink he has is this beat up old sink here. And it, he's already tried to screw it to the wall and it broke down there. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna install that yet. I gotta think about it and see what kind of wood I can find. Cause as you can see, just finding scrap wood like this around and doing what we can. So, so uh, that was my day's work today. It's awesome. Looks like, looks like Eddie Spaghetti had has uh, found himself a new bed. <laughs> huh, Kristen? Yeah. Ed Spaghed. These donkeys have actually been pretty funny. There's a, one of the, he's not here right now, but there's an old guy. He's just a miserable son of a gun. He chases the other ones around and bites them and think it's, it's very comical. And here, we have an official puppy pile. So second night with uh, Eduardo, he's uh, Eddie Spaghetti. He's uh, already found that that's his bed. Second night, he's seven weeks old, more than happy to be here. Um, can't say enough about this little bugger. Just happy to be here, wow. It's looking like he's gonna be our guardian dog. Always on the watch. This is Ed's big sister, Tuna. We are babysitting her while her new parents are away at a scuba diving excursion. So she'll be hanging out with us for the next few days. And of course, all the other siblings have to get in on the Kristen love. 
Good morning. Good morning. So today, you can see. We're taking it to the vet. And he's coming with us. <laughs> Crazy craziness, but yeah, running to town to uh, get all the shots and flea and dewormer and all that good stuff. We're gonna buy some supplies for the little place we're staying. Kristen's gonna cook a family type dinner and see if buddy can make some money. Yeah. So yeah, we're uh, kind of volunteering, working and have a free place to stay on a very nice beach. So right on. So um, Walmarts in this little town are hard. My van doesn't fit in the parking. <laughs> so I had to park a couple blocks away. I stayed the, with the pop in the van. Eddie. Kristen went in. But they won't let you leave the store with the grocery cart. So she got some random dude to come knock on the van to get my attention. So I ran up and had to make like four trips of groceries down the block. So yeah. lesson learned, don't uh, don't bring a van to little Mexico <laughs> to get, go to the big Walmart. It doesn't, it doesn't work. So uh, we went to the vet as well. And what an awesome guy he was. He, he, he spoke decent English and super, super sweet fella. Um, gave us lots of good advice. And so we got, he's got his first shot. And has got dewormer. Got dewormer shampoo because he didn't want to he thinks he's too young for any medication for fleas so we're just going to give him a couple flea baths and, and then we see him again in 20 days yeah so we're just next shots and some medicine so really grateful to the, for the people on facebook who uh and it was 55 dollars to see the vet and get all the medications at home that would have been 255 yeah it's bag of, it's, we got some really good puppy food um and the food was more money than the vet visit <laughs> which is insane right so we just want him to have good nourishment for the first little while of his little life because who knows what he ate before yeah he met us, right? speak a little louder i hope they can hear you honey i hope they can too um but yeah so we're heading back we got all our supplies uh from walmart and right, krista's gonna cook her first group dinner tonight yeah we think yeah that's the plan anyway that's the plan and we're gonna have, uh, she's gonna also offer um, the breakfast tacos breakfast. in the morning as well. So yeah, um, yeah kind of cool. Yeah. See you later. The guy was telling us last night that all these houses weren't here three years ago. So this area is developing fast. Yep. Beautiful place to build a house though, boy. Constant. Puppy chaos. Oh yeah, you cheat and grabbing Ed's collar. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, Eddie Spaghetti Head just had his first flea bath. He's shivering. He's cold. But he did such a good job. He, he didn't did, whine once. Didn't he just took it like a man. Sure did. With his sister. His sister got one too. Look at him. He's shivering because he's so cold. Poor Pepita. And then we'll comb you out with a fine comb. And get rid of those nasty little buggins. Good job, Eddie Spaghetti Head. Who do you got there? Oh, little Eddie Spaghetti jumping all around you. Yeah, right in the van, give, then give him a treat. Okay, come on, Ed. Ed. Good boy. Good boy. Good listening. Sit down, good boy. Good boy. Since Ed's moved in with us, living the good life, his siblings just seem to uh, be hosing around. The adventures of Eddie continue. Learning tug of war.
I mean, seriously, how can you just not love this little guy?